Hello, how's it going guys? Thank you for watching. For this video, I want to do a taste test on this right here. It is the Cereal School. Wait, no, that's the name of the company. It's Foodie Cereal, keto friendly obviously. It says no sugar ever, 16 grams of protein. I got this one from the latest Keto Crate. The price is $2.49. $2.49 for this? No way, that's crazy. Let me, uh, let me get into Amazon real quick, see what it says. All right, so nothing really pops up on Amazon, but I want to get into this, so, hey, hey. No vas a ayudarme, okay? But I want to try these, so let's get right into it. One bag is a serving size, which is 22 grams. It is 100 calories, 3.5 grams of fat, one gram of carbs, which is fiber, and then 16 grams of protein, so a lot of protein. I'm assuming the ingredients are gonna be just straight up whey protein. Ingredient, milk protein, isolate, high oleic sunflower oil, tapioca fiber, natural flavor, monk fruit, paprika extract. All right, so just by the ingredients, I'm assuming it's gonna be really chalky and, uh, hey, ¿me estás ayudando o no? I guess I got distracted. I didn't realize that the camera stopped recording. The um, uh, card was full. We didn't catch me opening and first reaction. So uh, I'm gonna try to, reenact the moment i opened it and immediately i smelled the flavor what i was saying is that that flavor is really strong it's like a really concentrated uh smell as soon as they smelled it they didn't like it yeah. it's almost like Spice. no it's almost like potpourri or something no artificial anything but it smells artificial to me the flavor is okay now i take it back so i don't i don't really like the flavor i do like the texture though uh the texture is like kicks it's nice and crunchy it's not powdery like i thought it was gonna be you can probably hear it i like the texture so much the crunchiness that i'm willing to put up with the flavor this crunchiness is really winning me over i really like that crunchiness there aren't a lot of keto friendly foods that are this crunchy. It doesn't seem like this would go well with milk. Yeah. It's almost like an orange. The aftertaste is not great either. I haven't eaten Fruit Loops in a long time, but I think that's what they were going for. Like a Fruit Loop type of flavor. I don't know if they got it though, since it's been so long since I ate those. When's the last time you bought a cereal bag this big? I guess. It's supposed to be a one serving because of the keto crate. It's a nice snack if they change the flavor. All right, so I'm looking at the website. It looks like this is the only flavor they have. They're selling 12 bags for $30. I'm on the fence about this one. Uh, I'm just not convinced that that, that flavor is gonna go well with milk. I don't have milk right now, otherwise I would try it with it. If I was forced to make a decision about it, I would probably get it just for the texture, just for that crunchiness, and then try to figure out a way to uh, make it taste better, but I wouldn't buy it for the flavor. That's pretty much it. Uh, I don't know if this helped you, but hopefully you guys liked this video. If you did, hit that uh, like button. Please subscribe to this channel. Also hit that bell so that you get notifications anytime I upload new videos. I have a bunch of them coming up, so stick around for those, and thank you for watching. See you guys, bye. Bye.